And then Simon from simonwoods.com. Uh, wine today, Domaine Romy, Beaujolais, 2013, um, Paul Baudet. I don't know. Well, I imagine Paul Baudet's a negociant and uh, Domaine Romy, maybe he's actually got this stuff from one estate uh, or maybe it's a made up name. I could be being unfair to Monsieur Romy or Monsieur uh, Baudet, but uh, maybe I should better shut up and taste it. Well, I wasn't expecting much, um, but I stick my nose in there and um, it smells okay. Um, Beaujolais, uh, we're between the Rhone and Burgundy, and I get elements of both. I get the spice of the Rhone and I get that soft, gentle, juicy fruit uh, of Pinot Noir in the uh, uh, in Burgundy. It smells like it's going to be a little bit on the simple side, ever so slightly jammy, and there's this stalky character as well. Um, maybe let's see if, if that comes across as being just a little bit too stalky when I taste it. Well, that's, I'm, 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 I'm lost for words. Um, it's better than I'm far better than I thought it was going to be. Um, there's a juicy, youthful crunch about it. Juicy, dark, uh, dark red fruit, if that makes sense. Things like mulberries, dark cherries, and uh, uh, there's this spice. There's a freshness about it. It's young, perky, sausage-friendly wine, and uh, the sort of thing that you want to have a large guzzle of rather than sip. Uh, sedately and serenely and um, so um, maybe I need to go and find myself some sausages and have a slug. See you later.